All right, guys, so we have just made the run inshore, fishing on uh, one of these inshore rigs. Didn't even get my camera set up, and look what we just pulled up. Stud sheep's head. Tanner just missed one, and uh, had a crab that we scooped up with a net. Didn't take five minutes to be Yeah, let's see what this guy measures. I'm gonna guess 20 inches. First fish, the screen is lit up right now. Three, 22, 21 inches to the fork. So yeah, first drop, we're fixing to drop some more crabs down and hopefully get some action on the camera for y'all. So I just got a little short leader, a 20 pound fluorocarbon, one uh, gamakatsu uh, hook there for the crab. We're just throwing along the legs here, letting it drift. Marking good on the screen, it's 53 foot deep right here. Got a couple boats here as well. Seen them hook up, some nice sheeps. It hasn't been taken long. What are you doing wrong? <laughs> oh, sitting here talking out my butt. Missed that fish. Hooked up? Hooked up, baby! I don't know. That's Small. snapper. Oh my gosh! You really just caught a croaker. <laughs> Guess this is how my day is going. Yeah. I feel like they're about 20 foot down, probably. Uh-oh. Catching a few. He must know me, too. No, he said, hey, Brandon Collier, or hey, Captain Collier, I love your YouTube. You already on? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Feel pretty good? Yeah. Here, go up that way. Let me, I'll get the net. I'll get it. Nice sheet, nice sheet. Stay pinned, stay pinned for us. Whoa, what are you doing? <laughs> I thought you learned how to knit. Uh, not so. 19 inch sheep right there. Good job. We really need to be on that down current side. They wrecking them over there. You getting a bite? Yeah. Catch? Oh, I just got a bump. Nice. Right under the boat. Right under the boat. Oh, yeah. It's not? What is it? Smallest snapper ever. They ride under the boat, I'm telling you. I got a sheep. Yes, you do. Real. Real sheep. I need them to stay pinned. Y'all, it is just every cast. Oh, yeah, another good one. Yeah. Another 18, 19 inch, probably. Come on. Let's go, bro. <laughs> Magnum. Only the hammers today. <laughs> Only the hammers. Sitting at 19 inches. Another good fish. Drop back down and get us a couple more. As y'all can see, we're just using these mud crabs that Tanner was nice enough to catch for us. Got a couple dozen in there. Like I said, we're just casting close to this rig here, getting close to the structure, letting the current just kind of drift it back. There you go. I seen that. Yeah. That's a good one. Tanner kicking some butt today. Hey. Bring him around here. Let me let me get a good net job on him for you. Nope. Come on, come on. Hey, if it's a state record, I'm cutting the line. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I don't have it anyways. That's a dang good one right there. Come on. No. Oh. He's big, but not that big. <laughs> Shoot. 19. 
Nice. Good little spot right there between that leg and that cross member there. He ain't no big one. He's a keeper though, I bet. Uh, let's net him. He ain't, he ain't huge, but I don't want to lose any. Man, it's just boats piling up over here. What we got? What we got? Yeah. Dang it. Yeah, buddy. Come on, don't you spit that hook right here at the boat. Saw that net, didn't want no parts. <laughs> he honestly is bigger than I thought he was. And he is not giving up. Golly. Come on, come on, get in the net. Oh my God. <laughs> you gonna get him this time? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. 16, 17, 18, 19 inch sheet right there, y'all. 19. 19. There we go. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Come on over here to Papa. He wanting to go that way. Come on over this way. Ooh. Another 19 inch. <laughs> That's the average today. Yes, it is. Eh, probably 18. Still, just some studs. Merging the seat right now, dude. 17, another. 18 inch sheet right there. That box is looking good. Yes, it is. So in case y'all are wondering, sheep's head aren't always like this at the rigs, but this time of the year, around March, at the end of March and April, when the water starts warming up, this is uh, the time for the sheep's head to come out offshore and spawn. And uh, it's a really good opportunity to come hit any kind of structure outside of the island, uh, rigs, jetties, the lighthouse, reefs, they all hold sheep's head. And uh, you'll, you'll know it's time whenever you pull the sheep out of the water and uh, the, the white ooze starts coming out. <laughs> that boat over there has been freaking wearing them out. That one? Yeah. They're, they're uh, chumming. Throwing up? No, they're oh, actually chumming. like stuff they've got crushed up already. Gotcha. Well, it helps to be on that side of the rig anyways because the baits are floating towards the structure. Right. I'd rather be on that side, but no need to go over there and crowd them. No, no. Not when we're catching some good ones right here. Getting a bump. Can I stick them this time? Oh, yeah. Come on, stay on. That's a good one. Very good one. This is just so much fun. Oh, it doesn't <laughs> get much better than this. <laughs> Look at that, how beautiful. Same, he's probably about 19 and a half. He was not coming off. Straight up swallowed that hook. Another good fish, y'all. This one? Yeah. It'll probably be about two weeks. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? Did you catch any? We got six before we out Okay. Have a good one. Man, I'm in the right spot. Right there where my line's at. I feel like I am too. Do you? You gonna keep them on the hook? Yeah. You sure? I ain't saying nothing. I ain't Yo, this is like the fourth sheep he's lost in a row. In a row, easily. I'm gonna let him swallow it. I, I don't wanna miss another one. 
Golly! <laughs> that that sucker had some weight. He had some weight to him. Pulled it. Of course, big ones. Oh, I got a little line for you, but I'm gonna run with it. Oh! You heard that? I did. I'm looking at it. <laughs> Please. I wasn't gonna lose that. Please thing. leave. Keep this fish on the hook. He looks like he's got some weight. Is this a new PB? Could be the 19. Could be the regular. Oh no, that sucker's got some weight. <laughs> He's fat, thick. <laughs> He's gonna be like 14 inches. <laughs> Red snapper. Oh yeah. He 20. No doubt about it. There we go. Me myself. Fat so. This is five. <laughs> 23, 2, 1, he's 20. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Come to pop up. That's a fat one. And he came off. Why? Why? I don't know why they're coming off. The big ones. They come off. I don't. But he's still got the crab. Take the crab this time. I don't know if that rod can handle it. And that's not a yeeter, buddy. <laughs> that's not a yeeter. You're right. I would go yeeter. Your confidence, your confidence level, I mean, I like it. I like it, but I'd hate to see you break that rod. Would you like some help? Maybe not. We'll see. Oh, he's barely up. Yeah. <laughs> Out of the boat is my friend. Took me a minute. Oh, God. What? Yeah. If we can stay pinned. <sighs> oh, my gosh. That's a good one. 20 incher. Mm. 20 incher, baby. Mm. <laughs> Look how dark he is. In the net. There we go. <laughs> in the net. Yes. There we go, y'all. This is probably what, number 13, 14, 14th sheet that we have that's over 19 inches. We're probably gonna call it quits here soon. We've got plenty of meat. And uh, yeah, it's been a good day so far. It's been absolutely killer, <laughs> y'all. Killer. There's a few boats at this rig. One, two. Three, four, five, including us, six. We're gonna go ahead and wrap this video up. Uh, actually shut the camera off and uh, we continue to catch some more, release some more as well. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed catching these fish. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and uh, hopefully the wind will stay like this. We can get out and do some more of this kind of fishing. So uh, we'll see y'all back out in the water next time.